Welcome back, Diecast community. I am your host, Eddie G. And tune in to Bunker Diecast channel. How is everybody doing? Are you well? Press for everybody. I be an example. I call somebody that you love, tell them that you love them. I want to thank you for coming down here. Once again, to the Diecast Bunker. You could have done anything with this time, small amount of time, but chose to spend it with me. Always appreciated. And I like to thank all my family, friends, supporters, and subscribers. That means you watch it right now. Don't look that way. Don't look that way. Yes, you. And all collectors, customizers, and content creators. That's right. Thank you for coming around for part two. If you didn't see my preview video. I don't know if I put a preview video on YouTube. I might have done it on IG. But anyway, I got two Silver Series premiums to open. And I got... A new moving parts and a moving parts from 1987 thanks to Mr. Jeff Brummett. So let's get to it. Bam, and we're back. The very first car we're going to open, boop, matchbox, moving parts. Mustang Boss 302. I have the green or gray one they have in this, I believe it is. It's the release before this one. Um, I, I don't like this new packaging, but, uh, what are you going to do? Paint looks pretty good. Bam. Metal body, plastic base, plastic tires as well, but I like these rims and tires on here. Very fitting, this black metallic. With that boss. Boop, look at that. That motor in there detailed up. Yep, them seats, window wipers, mirrors, spoiler for two and a half bucks. She's a beaut, she's a winner, and I'm excited to add her to the moving parts collection. The next moving parts is uh, courtesy of Mr. Jeff Brummett. This is from 1987, y'all. The cards beat. We're going to open this up. These are some of my favorite. The most simplest. These wheels, man. Metro. These wheels, man. Just the wheels alone. Look at that. Boop. Trash goes in there. And then you go like that. Boop. Boop. Look at that. It has double moving parts. You don't see that no more. How cool is that, man? This is plastic, but the cab is metal. And the base feels like metal. Feels pretty solid. So yeah, I'm happy to add this oldie to the collection. 1987, 30 some years old. There you go. How awesome is that, guys? And next up, Toyota GR Supra from the Silver Series Hot Wheels. Let's see. Bam, 2020 GR Supra. This does have a metal base and metal body. It's plastic tires, but these tires look great. I really like the livery on this one. Gran Turismo. That red, black, and white. 90 across the side. See that interior. Yeah. I'm glad I found this one. Collect these Supra, so. Oh no! Almost fell off the edge. Last but not least, very hard one to find, but let's get into it. Bam! I like it. Metal body, metal base, plastic tires, but look at the details you get with this. Let me see if this helps. Lights, Nissan badging, Nismo across the plate, brake lights are done, come around the front, see the GTR badge and the grill, 
Headlights are lenses. They're part of this. Gran Turismo. Across the windshield. Windshield wipers. Right hand drive. You can see the steering wheel through there. Detail in the back. I like it. It's a solid. This feels solid too. Surprise. Heck yeah, guys. Thank you guys for sticking around for part two. Hope y'all had a great weekend. I'm going to try to get around and do my rounds and watch everybody's content. Hope y'all have a great rest of your weekend and a great week, everybody. And I hope you find what you're looking for out there. Peace.